Our executive producer, showrunner right now, came to me and said, how do you feel about a girlfriend? He didn't even finish the word. And I was like, what, yeah, what, yes, yes, yes. I am gonna bring some of my other friends to our next meeting. Can I tell you something? Mm. I love it. So many people approach us all the time going, are you guys gonna do something together? Like, I'm not, I don't feel represented. Like, I wanna see us on TV. And it, there's a need for it. Like, I think yeah. it was really so many people talking to all of us over these years that really made it clear. <laughs> oh, it's been too long! So this episode is about feminism um, and the interesting divide that occurs in uh, the black community and white community around feminism. And so she brings her friends from college. I need your help uh, with a group of well-intentioned white women. Oh, mm -hmm. so basically what you're saying is you need black ups. I need it desperately. I love like how topical the subject matters are and how important they are. Mm -hmm. and. They do it in a way that is not aggressively in your face, but you hear it. I like that a lot about Blackish. Don't jump into a conversation about feminism unless you're sure you can hang. Equal Rights Amendment was a good idea, but we're still waiting to pass it here. Woo! All of the girls, the vibe and the connect that we do, like when we got back together, it was horrifyingly Normal. natural. Yeah, I was like, how has it been 11 years since we worked together and I hear your voice and it feels like, it just feels so natural and organic. Oh my goodness! I'm so glad you all could make it. Because the audiences are gonna just, they're gonna just really wanna, you know, Joan, Maya, Tony, they wanna just, you know, go back into that world. So I think we really captured pieces of that. <laughs> we have the best fans. Oh my God. Honestly, I mean, and I'm just so excited for them.